<laughs> you got this one? Yeah. Yeah, that's what you can do is log in and read me comments. Not even showing you. Mm -hmm. Hi, Jones family. Come on in. In the kitchen today. Going to be cooking up some green chili stew, Spanish rice, and pork taquitos. That is what is on our menu. I'm behind the scenes running cameras. <laughs> yes. So that's what we're working on today. So I'm going to go ahead and um, I got everything cut up uh, for the Pork taquitos, what you need is I bought center pork chops and just cut them up in uh, strips so that I can boil them with some taco seasoning and then I'm going to shred it. So I'm going to go ahead and put that on the oven. As you can see, I've got my pork in here. So I'm going to get that ready. And what I do is I'm just going to put one pack of just regular taco seasoning in it. That's all it's going to take. Put that in. Give it a little stir to mix up the seasonings. And just get it on the stove. One. Put my lid on. So that takes care of that. So my taquitos are started. They're making. So now what we are going to do is we're going to start on the uh, green chili stew. And in the green chili stew, your ingredients is, again, center pork, uh, cubed up, or any type of pork that you want, cubed up with potatoes, onions, uh, cilantro, Poblano peppers, jalapenos, and bell pepper. So we're going to start with this. Like I said, I already have everything cut up. So here's my pork. Take it over to the stove. Bear with me. Get some roll out. Hold on just for a second. Let me move this to where I can see better. Okay. I'm going to put that in the pot. Let's see if y'all can see any better than I can. There we go. I can't see. There it is. <laughs> All right. Put that in the pot. We're going to turn it on to medium and start letting that brown a little. Give it a little... Stir up. Hopefully everyone is staying warm and dry today. I know our temperature right now is, what was it, 38? It's 38 degrees and it is raining. And cold. And cold. So we're trying to stay inside, indoors today. 
as much as possible. We had to get out for a little bit today. But I got that on the stove now. Um, with the rice, we're going to start that here in a little bit. It's not really that time to cook the rice because everything else takes a little bit longer. But with the rice, I'm going to use um, uh, just regular cooking rice. But I'm going to use a tomato bouillon base uh, to put in it. I'm also going to put onions in it, uh, bell pepper, and tomatoes will go into the, into the rice. Um, if you have any questions, please feel free to ask. Charlie's going to be reading me the comments while I'm going. Uh, let's see. We have... Like I said, we have everything cut up. Let me show y'all what we have here. We have the cilantro, the tomatoes, bell peppers. We have the onions. This one's for the soup, and this one is for the rice. Then we have the potatoes. We have the all the green peppers. And, of course, the tortillas for the uh, taquitos to fry the taquitos with. Thank you, thank you. Um, I haven't really made this recipe in a while. Don't Normally, let her fool you, she's never made it. I make it all the time. Exactly, he <laughs> makes it, but I watch him. I do, and it was my idea to cook this today, so he's like, well, do you want me to help you, or what? Time like, to learn. Yeah. Yay. So, like I said, if you have any questions, please feel free to ask. Um, now is the time since there's no, no interruptions. <laughs> yeah, no interruptions from. Am I interrupting you all there? No, I'm talking about with uh, Autumn. Oh, so far. So far. She's keeping herself occupied so far. Okay. Right now, what I'm doing is I'm going to go ahead and start the the ingredients the, with the, the... The way we, that I make Spanish rice. Yeah, he makes Spanish rice different than I do. I normally fry my rice beforehand <laughs> and then do all of the vegetables and cook it with the tomato sauce and everything. He doesn't, he doesn't do that. So he likes to take and boil it with all of the ingredients in it. So I'm gonna, since I'm doing his recipe, I'm gonna do it his way. You don't hear a lot of women saying that. So, so and the other ingredient in the rice is gonna be cumin. And do some ground cumin in it. And I will, um, as best as I can, put in the recipe at the bottom. But we, like he says, we don't measure things. <laughs> we go by taste. So with that being said, everything's by taste. But like I said, um, everything's going to take a little while to really get going. I wanted to go step by step because a lot of people, I have actually mentioned this to before, is like, well, I want to know how you make it and how you do this, how you do that. Da, 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 da. So I decided to just go step by step, except for the cut up ingredients part. So he's running around chasing Autumn right now. That's the reason why he's not right in here. She's getting into everything. She started walking. And so now she's being a little hellion. <laughs> Very much. Hello, her healthy home. Okay. Oh, wow. 36. Not not far off from what we are. 
Not far at all. Yep, them ingredients are great together. Yes. Okay, so I have everything on the stove is cooking. I have my pork for my taquitos. I have my pork for my um, uh, green chili stew is cooking. I have my rice set up, and it's going. So the only thing left to do is just wait for everything to really get happening. This is the fun part. Everybody likes this part. So I'm going to show y'all this. This is the pork for the green chili stew. Then I have the rice. And then here, right here, is the pork for the uh, taquitos. Yummy, yummy, yummy. And the rice. I did show them the rice. Oh, the bell pepper. Oh, I forgot to put the bell pepper in the rice. Yeah. I did the onions, but I forgot the bell pepper. Oops, my bad. And what about? I did put. I did put that in already. See, he's, he's telling me, did I do this? Did I do that? <laughs> I'm trying to help. He's a background runner. Okay, so now, because the pork is pretty much ready to go to the next step, we're going to add the jalapenos, poblano peppers, and bell peppers to the mixture. That in my sink. Yep. Let's give that a good stir. It makes it so pretty. Okay, I got that in there. And now here we're going to go with the onions. Give that a good stir. How's that looking so far? Ooh, ain't that party? I wish you had smell a vision. Oh, it's smelling good. Huh? Yes. Okay, okay we're going to put some in it. Hmm. Put all of it in? Okay. He said to put it all in. So that's fine with me. How much? Not much. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, she said, how much was it? How much was it? Not much. Well, that's... I love the smell of this. We're going to put some cilantro in it after we do our seasonings. We're going to use some garlic powder. Some onion powder. Some 
some paprika. A little more, he says. He says, okay. So let's go ahead and stir all of this. Always add more seasonings. Yeah, you, you add too much. You can't take away, but you can always add two. So that's going green, Mom. That's the start up pretty good. So now I'm going to put some cilantro in. I love the smell of cilantro. It is so good. Some good smelling stuff. Very good herb. Oh, I forgot to put that in my rice, too. Okay, let's stir that cilantro in. My pork for the taquitos is coming to a good boil. And Autumn's over there just... Yes, it is going to be amazing. Um, if y'all have any questions about anything, if I'm throwing you for a loop, or if you have any questions about our channel, or, or um, autumn, or anything, the greenhouse, I mean the hot tunnel, anything that we do, just start asking away. Just ask. We don't hide anything. Okay. So let me start this uh, pork for the taquitos. Give that a good stir, mix it all around, incorporate all of these juices. Now, when you go to make your taquitos, you probably won't use all of the pork. So you can take that pork and you can either freeze it or you can make tacos or you make pretty much anything out of it. Uh, taco salad. Pork taco salad. <laughs> yep. Or you can take it and leave it in the juice and put it over Spanish rice. Pork. Pork board. So where exactly is everyone at that's in here? Where are y'all located? Everyone knows we're in Dayton, Texas, down by Houston, 30 miles outside of Houston, actually. Um, I'm going to put the water in. Hey, you're fogging up? Yep, I'm fogging up. <laughs> Four cups of water. Okay, you can do four cups of water. Well, I'm going to get some more. <laughs> okay, he said he's going to get some more. That's for the green chili stew to tell you. There we go. There it is. <laughs> West Tennessee. Tennessee. We went through there. What? Give me just a second. So, four more cups of water be eight. So, eight cups of water to the green chili stew. 
growing up here, I don't know if y'all did where y'all are, have a restaurant and it was uh, called Poncho's. And it was a buffet restaurant, Mexican buffet restaurant. But they used to serve this green chili stew there. And as a kid, you would take the green chili stew. You did that on purpose, didn't you? And you would take Spanish rice with the taquitos and mix it all together and then put um, queso cheese over the top of it. At least that's the way me and my sisters did it. We was the oddballs. Um, <laughs> but it was just amazing. And uh, they shut down all of the ponchos restaurants around here all but one and it's maybe what about 70 miles away from here so we'll take a drive every now and then and go eat there i don't know if it's still open now since all of this has happened with the covid situation so i'm going to turn my rice down to low because it's starting to boil and i'm going to Check my pork again for the taquitos. It's looking so pretty. Charlie's asking all of them, do you want to go be on camera? Coffee. We had to actually go buy a new coffee Craig, this morning, we got up this morning to, oh, hi. Adam's got to say hello. Say hi. We got up this morning to make us some cups of coffee, and <laughs> it just went out. You smart me, ain't you? So we had yeah, to go yeah. buy a new, uh, new coffee pot, new Keurig. I got to squat down and get in the picture. <laughs> say hi, Adam. Say hi. Say hi. I think I'm, it is what, 307 here? I might make me a cup of coffee and join y'all. I am, I'm a coffee freak. I love coffee. Yes, I do. Okay, so I got this pretty much stirred up for the uh, green chili stew. Let me get out a spoon so I can taste it. Let's see. Right, you hear? He put it down. <clears throat> Actually, it's going to need some salt and some pepper and some more garlic powder. And onion powder. But the paprika and all of that is pretty much good. The cumin is pretty good in it. Let me grab the salt and pepper. I'll be right back. Don't get to see behind the scenes. Huh? <laughs> oh, that's not pepper. That's something that he threw in there. A lot of times he will take and throw a seasoning that has very little in it or that he made up and he'll take and just throw it in a salt and pepper container and I won't know what it is. So what I just added was pepper and now I'm adding salt. I just added a little more onion powder, garlic powder to it. Give that a good stir. Okay. I got my rice turned down to low and my pork. I'm still boiling my pork for my taquitos. Um, let's see, for my taquitos. Oh, I still forgot to put this in the rice. <laughs> I still forgot to put my uh, cilantro in my rice. Just a little bit more. There we go. You gotta have cilantro in the rice. 
So, and uh, I will be, I don't bake the taquitos. I will be frying them, deep frying them. So w once I get to that point, I'll set everything up and let y'all watch all that, get them rolled and everything. So when you get to a point, where do you go to the bacon? Okay, I'm to that point. So what we're going to do is we're going to let this all cook and we're going to take the camera to the other room with us and have a Q&A with y'all. Q&A. He says Q&A. That's funny. <laughs> so we're going to come in here. Like I said, I'm not sure uh, where everyone is from. Let me grab my drink real quick. There we go. I uh, seen some of them was in Tennessee. Uh, you got it? He's got to move my stuff. My junk, he says. No, no, I have it on low. Okay, he's coming, y'all. Waiting for you. Yeah, you were rambling on in there in the kitchen. You get in here and sit down, and you don't know what to say. No, I don't know what to say <laughs> whenever it's like this. Now, in the kitchen, I'm good in the kitchen. Nope. You know? got a lot more people now. <laughs> oh, so I can just sit there and talk about what I'm cooking in the kitchen. We are going to be having. Uh, Hi, Ladybug. Gail, how you doing, Gail? Mommer Steve, Green, Going Green, Mom. Uh, who else we got in here? Jones family, I guess they're still here. Ashley. She's from the UK. Oh, nice. Esther's Garden and Victor. So Ashley, Ashley, right? Ashley's. Ashley, you're from the UK. Um, well, you should be yeah. going into what spring no, going now? Green, going green, mom's in the UK. Oh, okay. I'm sorry, sorry about that. Going green. Are you going into spring now? I know part of it's um, probably how far away is Conroe from here? Conroe. Mm -hmm. What's that got to do? With Just tell me how far away Conway is. About 40 miles. Okay, about 40 miles from here. They're having snow. They are. Yes, they are. Lucky them. Yes. And <laughs> where my brother, where my brother is, he's <clears throat> up by um, Odessa. And right before New Year's, they had 18 inches of snow. And now they're getting a, another snowstorm. They sent a picture and no, just whew, it's all white and everything i'm like no i'll stay down here she, no no she's no not in the uk she's going green months in northern indiana oh okay let's see i'm going by with what in he the said well i can tell you what said. wow 99 to 100 Woo. Oh, yeah, he, he's in Australia, I believe. Bummer, see this. Okay. He's a pretty good looking guy. <laughs> okay. You, 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 you haven't been in the lives where he's always no. on lives. No, I really don't get into the lives that much. Because I'm working. She needs to. I do need to. I I we get home. We could do it on the weekend. We could, but the weekend is when I do like the, a lot of times the cooking videos or get caught up on my laundry and housework and everything else and spend time with Autumn. That's my twenty four seven. Yeah, that's his twenty four seven. Um. As some of you might know, we have. Um, Let me check on. Buddy. Okay, we are raising our granddaughter. We've had her since she was four months old. Uh, she just turned a year old. 
um, we're raising her for now. So our lives have just literally turned upside down right now. We're used to having the house to ourselves and, oh, She fell. Okay, she fell. <laughs> She's trying to start walking. So, um, my husband's name is Charles. Um, sorry, it's instinct. But um, what I was talking about is we've had our, you know, used to just getting up and going whenever we want, and all of that has changed. Uh, right now, but it's all changed for the good. She is a wonderful little girl. Uh, let's see. Let's go in here and check on on my food. I hear it in here going away, so hang on. Bear with me. Let me check on everything. Okay. All right, so the taquitos that we'll be making the beef, uh, the uh, pork with is pretty much ready to go. Let me start this real quick. Give me just a second. Bear with me, everybody. I'm doing two things at once. Well, actually, four things at once. So um, the green chili stew, like I said, we have cooking. It's probably going to cook for a good 30 minutes to 45 minutes so that the everything gets tender. My uh, pork for the taquitos is cooking up pretty good. And of course, the rice is doing amazing. It's looking really good over here. I am gonna add just a little bit more water to my rice. Okay, add just a little bit more water to the rice. There we go. Okay. Now I come back in here. I apologize. Apologize. Why am I braver than you for taking on the, the grandbaby? Uh, you know, it's something else, though. <laughs> Here. Let me, um, we'll be back in just a minute. Let me check on her. She got a knot. It's not Way too fast. Way too fast. 
Okay. Leave it alone. We're still here. She's okay. She just wanted grandma. <laughs> Yep, she falls a lot. Here lately, she's been a little clumsy girl. Where is she? There it is. There it is. <laughs> Try, trying to figure out where the lens is. Now who's in here? Put me beside your name and type type out me so I know who's in there. Me. <laughs> I can read off of your phone better than I can mine. Yeah, she got a little knot this time. She never gets a knot. Hey, Riley. Jones family's still here. Bomber Steve's still here. Joy's here. Going Green is still here. I'll have to find that video few years back when we got six inches of snow here and uh, I'll put that on my channel one day when I find that video the kids made like a seven foot snowman everybody was coming to our apartment we lived in apartments back then everybody was coming there to take pictures with the snowman <laughs> What you doing? You got a headache now? <laughs> well, I bet Wisconsin's one of the coldest states around, I believe. My sister, uh, I think, she lives there in the, in the summertime, but they they go to their house in Arizona in the winter. But Arizona gets cold. I guess they don't get snow though. Huh? That's good going green, Mom. Only eight. Better than two foot. Do the states up north shut down when there's a lot of snow? I don't know nothing about up north. I don't see how people get up and go to work and drive in ice and sleet and snow and survive. I, would, I couldn't do it. I did it one time here in Houston back in the 80s when it was like nine degrees here with snow and ice all over the roads. I had to drive 50 miles to work. I didn't think I was going to ever get there or make it home. It's crazy. Especially on Houston highways. Never shut down, huh? Wow. 
I knew a guy that lived in Ohio, and he lived at the bottom of a hill. And uh, I said, how do you get up that hill when it's snow and icy? There's no jeans. And drive careful. Yeah, down, down here where we live close to Houston, we had six inches of snow back in I don't remember what year it was, 2006 or something like that. Feet in a few hours. <clears throat> no blizzards for me, please. Let me get my drink. <clears throat> It's going down already, it looks like. That's about like that day when she fell on the, the, the recliner for you, that lever, and put a dent in her head. Okay. I got her pretty much settled down now. <laughs> she got a little bobo right here. That's just her normal head. Yeah. <laughs> uh, okay, so what did I miss? People talking about snow. Snow. No. Oh, they do, Joy. I didn't know that. What? Up north, they teach you how to drive in snow with driver's head. Oh. Huh. That's cool. Can you say I've, hi? I've drove in it before, but it's no fun for hi? us Southerner people trying to drive on ice because our cars aren't made for it. Say hi. <laughs> say hi. What? I don't know. Huh? Okay. She's watching TV. She don't care. But I do need you to take her so I can go check the, the food. Never done that. I guess I could figure out how to do it, bomber. What is it? A moderator. Moderator. How do you do that? I don't know. We're on our phones. Let's see. Oop, I'm messing up. He's messing my phone up. Y'all bear with us there. We're back, <laughs> maybe. We're new to, to that. Stay with us. With some Cheetos? Mm -hmm. Am I live again? Yep. Anyway, <laughs> Bomber Seed. We're on our phone. I don't really know how to do it on StreamYard to create moderators. I think I could bring you up on the uh, screen if you want to join us. You've never done that before either.
cannot happen here. What are you doing? I'm saying this is ready. It's not ready. I need you to help me. <laughs> okay. You you have chat over here, but how do you text back? Do what now? Oh, okay. You can't add moderators from StreamYard. Oh. I could have had guests. Yep. But how do you tap on your I I've never done it. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if you can. Let me see something. Bear with me, people. We're going to no. play with it. Let's spram. I mean, yep. See, we would do that. Oh, I guessed. Okay. But I can't paste the link in. <laughs> Copy to clipboard. Oh, yeah, because I can't. I don't know how to. Sorry, y'all. Stay with us. He's trying something out. What, how you paste it in there? <laughs> I don't know. Oh, that's not real. Let's see. And Autumn's okay now. She's eating Cheetos. She's so, a Cheeto baby. So we're getting close to that thousand mark. Hallelujah. Yeah, what? Yeah, I think we need, what, 40, 45. 45 more people, and we'll be at the thousand mark. Yeah, I know how to do that, Joy. Oh, okay. I think I'm doing now. Yes, Cheetos makes everything better. Let me get off. Especially this. with her. I'll get on the computer. She Go. is. We introduced her to Cheetos not that long ago. She, it was funny because she had never ate anything sweet or anything like that salty. and yeah sweet salty nothing she you know we've strictly done she didn't baby like food homemade sweet. baby food stuff like that so on her first birthday i decided i was just going to get her a cupcake and let her try it out so we have the cupcake and everything in front of her and she didn't like it i i tried putting it in her mouth and she gagged on it she she didn't like cake at all she didn't yeah she didn't like the sweetness of it or anything but he's taking a pickle a, a sour dill pickle and not sour just a dill pickle. okay just a dill, dill pickle and he's let her taste the juices of the pickles and she doesn't even make a, a face she loves it um she the Cheetos, like I said, we just started here recently, not that long ago, and she's impressed by them. We'll do the cheese puffs to where it melts in her mouth because she still only has the two bottom teeth. She's breaking the top two. Uh, watch hours. We only got 300 and something watch hours, so we'll have to start over next year, this year. Does anyone know if uh, the live watch hours count towards – the watch hours live stream cast. yeah live stream there she goes she's off again i'm gonna go check on the food real quick oh I'll you're gonna leave me while i'm trying to work on this huh we'll work on 
on it. Hurry. Well, I got to find out where it is. She's got to find out where it is. I don't remember is. where all this stuff is. That's videos. That's good. I've seen. Okay. So they do count. Um, but your hours start over every year is what Charlie was telling me. Correct. Is that correct? Or does it keep the hours accumulating? <laughs> I mean, we're not sure on how all this works. Oh, thank you very much. We actually had a short video that has <laughs> taken off, uh, kind of gone viral. Uh, before it did, it had like, what was it, 700 views or 300 views? Yeah, it was 300. It was like 300 views. views and within a couple weeks, it's already up to 855,000. And it just really shocked me. And it's so stupid. It's my flat tire. And I was coming home on our road and I was like two blocks away from, from our house. And um, I ran over a uh, 3 8 extension. And people's like, there's no way that could have gotten lodged in your tire and flattened your tire. They're saying that we did it, that we put it in there and everything. No, we didn't. Anything can happen. It's, it's you know, it's weird, but anything can happen. And then come to find out that, you know, there's a gentleman that works at a tire shop and he was sitting there saying that, what was it, a, a a fish bone or something like that? Oh, uh, pork chop bone. Oh, pork chop bone. He had to remove a pork chop bone. Um, your video, children, you have a sound oh, Okay, okay. If it's muffled, it doesn't count. Okay. Do what? Um, saying that if anyone runs our videos to tell them um, the sound about the sound. What are you doing, monkey? I don't know if anybody's run our videos but Chrissy. Well, she's going to. Joy is. Then we have one of uh, a short of Autumn for the first time set still watching a movie and it would, happened to be in the non-animated Lion King. And she fell in love with it and just started laughing and everything through it. So that one's kind of picking up a little. But I don't think you get watch hours on shorts, he said. So. What are you looking for? I'm looking for bomber thing <laughs> under my subscriptions. That ain't, you know. Is that the Australian? Yeah. He's looking for you. Oh, okay. Thank you. Go on green. That's mm. having a playlist. Most definitely, we're going to have to try to... I do got to check my food. Check your food. Oh, okay. I've seen you, Bomber. <laughs> Just didn't recognize the guy playing the guitar.
I'll work on that later. I got Steve. Okay. Okay. So just got back from <clears throat> checking everything on the stove and hey, boots and bounty. The pork is almost ready to be taken off to do the taquitos with. Texas. <laughs> To do the taquitos with, so we're gonna move in there. You want to talk in here while oh, I do this? We're gonna do what? It's time to do the taquitos. Time to cook. I'm ha I'm having fun here. Well, then you stay I, here. That's all right. We'll take the camera in there. Mom or Steve, you should be a moderator now, but I don't see it. I guess it don't work in Streamyard. We'll just have to start going live on our computer. Going down here. Yes, right here. Okay, so I got. Oh, I got to turn this one on. Okay, so I got the um, the uh, pork, pork off of the stove so I can take and start uh, doing that up. But I need to add the tomatoes to the um, to the green chili stew. Yes, and we're going to turn it down to simmer. But let me add all of these fresh, beautiful tomatoes. Look at how pretty those tomatoes are. So now, oh, the potatoes. No, not yet. Not yet? Okay. Not yet. So can say, I forgot the potatoes too. I'm just going out of my mind right now, and I don't know why. So let me grab a bowl. So we're going to need a bowl for this. Like I said, it's not going to take all of this pork to do the taquitos because it's just him and I, you know, and take that juice and pour it in the green chili soup. Yep. Well, I'm going to need some. Okay. Just a little bit for this. Yeah. Okay. So I got my pork in the bowl. I'm just going to take two forks. Where am I at? I don't know. You moved me. I'm a bad cameraman. <laughs> He's a bad cameraman. Bad, bad. And we're just going to break it up really fine is what we're going to do. Yeah. Because you don't want big chunks in the taquitos itself. It's kind of like, uh, I guess, um, Making tamales, you want it kind of fine, not chunky. The phone is too heavy. <laughs> <laughs> You're going to hear me pulling this, this pork. My daughter, she does um, the pulled pork on tostadas and and she'll make the pulled pork sandwiches and with barbecue sauce and everything. And I'm not big on pulled pork. I'm not really big on pork. Yeah. I don't either, huh? Yeah. Yeah. 
so um if you're on a diet this is not a good diet <laughs> it's it's not a good diet food at all a lot of starch but you know what I'm not on a diet And a good thing about this, too, is with the taquitos, you can take and make as much as you want, and you can freeze them. And then you can take and, you know, just warm them up later. Milk prep for the week. We have any comments? Put your glasses on. <laughs> uh, he's being a being a Charlie right now. He knows I can't see. And you have glasses on your hand. I yeah. have glasses on my hand. Your head. <laughs> Yes, my glasses are on my head. Okay, I'm gonna do that for right now and see how many this pork makes. Let me add a little bit of the juice to the pork so it doesn't get too, too stringy. You know, Charlie makes um, really good uh, homemade enchiladas also. He is a great cook. He is an amazing cook. Ooh, I don't like that noise. Okay, so let me grab a couple of tortillas. And we're gonna start rolling them out. Yes, I don't make my homemade, I don't make homemade tortillas. I cheat. I'm not a tortilla maker. <clears throat> uh, let me get a little plate. I don't know what he's doing. He left me. He says, I'll be there in a minute. He's pulling to me, is what he's doing. Oh, he's doing more monitors. Okay. All right. So we're going to take this and we're going to move it and just wrap and roll. It does help, though, if your tortillas are a little bit wet, it helps work with them a little more. But I don't like frying them that way. I mean, I can try it. <laughs> Get some more. Yummy, yummy, yummy. And these are just going to be mainly for, I mean, you eat them, yes, but mainly for dipping, sopping up the, the juices. As people say, sopping the gravy. But these tortillas are not holding. You know what? I think I'm going to use flour tortillas. Because these tortillas are not working. They are breaking apart. I know I should have got yellow. <laughs> we can do some big ones then. Bear with me. <laughs> Tortilla just tore. <laughs> okay. 
we're going to change to wheat tortillas. I say it's not good diet food. Well, guess what? It's wheat. It's good. So I'm going to try this again. That's why I'm going to cook. That's why you to cook? Yeah. Oh, he says that's why he's to cook. Okay. The rice done? Yes, the rice is done. All right. That works. It's going to be one big tortilla. Smooth, Penny. Go. Yep, big, big, big. Yeah, they do have to be heated to work with a lot better. But I really don't like corn tortillas. She does. I'm not really that much of a corn tortilla type person. She forgot the real tail. <laughs> She finally made it back in here. So we're going to shred up some more because he'll eat a couple of them. Me, I'll eat one. So I'm going to go ahead and shred up some more of the pork. So how many of y'all in here watch sports? We ain't sports. We're not, don't sports talk about it. we're not at sports people in this house, but had a friend of mine call me last night. Well, I work with her also, and she called me and says, we were driving through y'all's town, and we stopped at this restaurant, and we left <coughs> my husband's hat. Will you go get it and bring it to me? And I'm like, yeah, I can do it. And he's like, well, first, how do you like the Texas A&M? It just turned off. He's like, how do you like Texas A&M? I'm like, ah, it's no LSU. So I went and picked it up for him. And then I told him, I said, well, I got a cheap hat for sale. Okay, that should be enough for one more. Like that for him. There we go. Take and roll it. And stab it with a toothpick. I'm going to come back over here to the stove so I can get my wok and everything ready with the oil. Get this heating so I can fry those. Just a second, I need to get some more oil. Okay. I'm going to take oil. Yes, oil in the walk. In the walk. Let's see if I can talk about the walk. There we go. All right. Now turn this on, get that heating up, and dinner is almost done, y'all. Oh, 
I'm going to take the rest of this pork that was going into the um, taquitos, and I'm going to go ahead and just pour it all into the green chili stew. And I do have to add the potatoes to the green chili stew. Just put the potatoes in. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Okay, that stirred up really good. All right, I got the potatoes added. Let y'all look at it here. Yummy, yummy. Look at all that yummy goodness. And then I got, of course, my oil cooking, waiting. My beautiful rice. Yes, yes, yes. It is going to be beautiful. So, okay, I got the, sorry, I got a little sidetracked. Squirrel. <laughs> okay, so, um, yeah, I think a lot of meat in them. I'll just make sure they're tight. He's over there checking my stuff. Checking my tequitos. I'm going to make that one. He's over there checking. Okay, so we got that going. It's heating up pretty good. Probably put that in already. Woohoo! Lovey, lovey, lovey. So I guess that's why I'm waiting for that. I could come back over here and we can chat with y'all some more. Behind the scenes. Here we go. Mm. Down. There we go. You're kind of leaning. <laughs> Am I leaning? I'm leaning to the left. Leaning to the left. Okay, so we're back. I'll let you know when I taste it, Bomber Steve. I did put two jalapenos in it, one without seeds and one with seeds. So I'll find out. <laughs> we like hot, though. Hot is good. I like a little hot. I don't like something so hot I burn every time I taste it. Yeah, that's true. Bite it. That's very true. Mm -hmm. Autumn says she don't like hot at uh, all. She might. <laughs> Later on, she might. What are you doing? I don't know what all the comments have been. I haven't been able to keep up with them. Let's see. Let us catch up on the comments. Uh, they're all talking to each other. Oh, okay. It's not hot enough. <laughs> is that your theory, Bomber Steve? If you're not sweating blood, it's not hot enough. Oh, Lord. I don't go past. Jalapeno peppers. All these people eating ghost peppers and Thai peppers and all that. You can have it. Okay. So I'm going to take and. Breathe. So you just left me in here. You ain't going to let them see you crying these things up in case they fall apart on you? She, she's scared. I think I'll take the camera back in there no! and let them watch. Let y'all watch her mess up. He is not right. Yeah. Not right.
<laughs> She's never made these before, and I haven't either. No. I've, Hello, Lala. I've watched videos on YouTube with it. That's why I get a lot of my recipes and stuff from this from YouTube. <laughs> And we don't go live that much, so we figured we'd give this a try. Got the green chili stew. What you call them things right there? Taquitos. Taquitos. That's a big taquito. That's a big taquito. And some. That's right. That's my, my version of gringo Spanish rice. <laughs> What? Then we got Autumn. We got Autumn over here. Say hi. Say hi. Hi. Okay, so we are going to let the uh, taquitos cook. And that's what I'm doing. I'm going to find the taquitos. Get three of them. Six. I want to grow some cayenne pepper and let it dry this year, and uh, put it in our coffee grinder and make a uh, cayenne pepper powder. Give that a try. Because I use I use a lot of cayenne pepper powder that you buy from the store, but I'd like to try doing it myself fresh. What? <laughs> well, we, we don't grind our coffee anymore, so. Randy always buys th different things to try it out, but um, she decided she didn't like grinding coffee. It was too slow of a process. A hand grinder, huh? I haven't never seen a hand uh, coffee grinder. I'll have to show you some of my antique uh, meat grinders one day that my parents left behind. It was supposed to be in their parents. What? And all you beehive people, I got an old uh, smoker for beehives that I found. As you can see, they turned out beautiful. They came out beautiful? They came out beautiful. <laughs> well, they can't see them in here. I'm going to do that for one second. Hold up. Let's go, let's go check out our taquitos. Or huge ones. See, they turned out beautiful. Look at that. Beautiful coloring. I know what I'm doing. Say hi. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, she's she's all right. She she got a little knot on her head, but she's fine. Sure makes me feel bad though. Why? Why? You want to be in the movies again? Yeah, there you go. You see yourself? Say hi. Uh -huh. Dirty face. Cheeto face. Okay, so all we're waiting on now is just the um, stew. Stew. That's fine. Get back in here and talk to these people. <laughs> <laughs> right. 
Yep. I put a little paprika in there. Bomber. But our paprika here isn't spicy. It's just for flavor. Guess what I'm doing? I'm making me some coffee. Coffee? Coffee. Yeah. I'm, I'm maybe a two cup in the morning, man. That's all. Hi, everybody. I'm back. <laughs> hey, we're back. We're back. Yeah, this is our first attempt, Bomber Steve, at doing a live yeah. and cooking. Yeah. Of course, I had two cameras set up, and one of them, the SD card, wasn't big enough to do maybe 20 minutes. So I got to get a bigger SD card. Yeah, I put I put paprika on my barbecue too, and chili powders sometimes. I just mix it all up. I just try different things all the time. <laughs> she get a little wild. Go, go get her a snack. Now. Get, hey, hey, hey! What's the matter? You're gonna be happy now, ain't you? Huh? Thank you. Say thank you. Say thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> You're welcome. She's a mess. Trying to teach you how to say thank you. Okay. But my energy, I... Well, your green <laughs> mom's because she's so young. <laughs> zero <laughs> not much energy right now though i've been fighting a migraine since friday three days yeah three my... days with a migraine i got my dax pierced for migraines <laughs> and it it does help on certain migraines um and then i have medicine migraine medication but it's nothing's working I'm going to have to find some smoked paprika. I can't find it in the stores here. I got to go to bigger stores, I guess, that might have it. Yeah, we got these little country bunkin stores here. I'm going to smoke the peppers, papers. Peppers. <laughs> the dehydrated ground. I guess, I, what, what kind of wood would you smoke peppers with? La la? <laughs> <clears throat> Me too, Bomber. I'd like to see how he does that. I would like to see that too. That that's interesting. Very interesting. I'm not giving y'all a stink face or anything like that. I'm I'm trying to read. I don't want to put my glasses on. I have very bad eyes. <laughs> Okay, I'm going to have to. Uh, hey, I can see. I married you? Oh, my God. <laughs> Don't worry. I got my eyes fixed, so I can see, too. <laughs> oh. <laughs> How? Whoa. I don't know what that was about. I had a pop-up. Saying that someone was going live. What you? What's that? That's LinkedIn. What are you doing on LinkedIn? That's for business people. Duh. <laughs> yeah, but you gotta watch this LinkedIn. Yeah, feeling the love, right? Ah, oh, bad day. Don't touch me. No. <laughs> We've been married for twenty-five years, so. <laughs> I think it's time to trade him in. Well, I'd trade you in for a couple of 20s, but I don't think I can handle it anymore. <laughs> well, oh, no. Man, 
loose gears, wedge peppers, and corn. Tight. Did you lose um, it? Mesquite. I have to give that a try, Jason. Get, I may give me some seeds planted. I'll probably do that tomorrow if Autumn lets me. <clears throat> Get some seeds planted in the house, set them by the window, and let them uh, do the thing. And they'd get. I, I'm always dragging behind on planting stuff late. Like I got my broccoli planted late, my cabbage planted late, but it'll make by the time spring gets here. <coughs> Infused with bourbon. Oh, bourbon pellets. <laughs> and we soak the peppers in some bourbon and then smoke them. <clears throat> Bourbon infused pellets. We got a pellet pit, but I've, I haven't seen that. Of course, I haven't been to any stores that would carry anything <laughs> exotic. <laughs> You're sitting there eating that Cheeto and whining. What is wrong with you? Can't eat it fast enough? Got my coffee. Yeah, good waste of bourbon, huh? I got me a bottle of uh, it's called Weller bourbon. It's from Kentucky, and I sip on that every once in a while. She's eating her Cheetos and whining. Your head hurt? It should. <laughs> Little Frankenstein. That's kind of swollen. Isn't it? Like, like you said, long as it ain't indented. Is it springtime yet? I'm sick of winter already. We just we just starting. Well, we'll have maybe the uh, rest of January and February, then it'll start warming up around here after February. <laughs> About the end of March, it'll be it'll be fishing time. Okay, Lala, we'll see you later, ma'am. Thanks for stopping in and saying hello. Maybe our live chats will get popular and we'll have more than seven people, but I like the small ones because the chat screen doesn't run so fast you can't read it. Oh, yeah, whiskey sire. I haven't had a whiskey sire in years. <clears throat> it just made me want one. <laughs> so I don't have the stuff to make it. I guess I can put some lemon juice in the whiskey to make it sour. Hang on. Hang on. Oh, Joey was a drinker? Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, I cut back on drinking a lot. I used to like to drink, but it don't like me anymore. I had to sip and drink slowly now. So is it time? Is it time to eat it? No. No, not yet. 
we'll stay on longer then. Since since this might count towards uh, moderation hours, <laughs> monetizing hours. What you gonna feed her? Mashed taters. Her favorite. Thirty years ago, Joy. It must be nanny. <laughs> Only what? joking. See, I quit drinking thirty years ago. <laughs> Hang on, monkey. And I grew up around a bunch of drinkers, and then then I used to DJ bars for a little side job. It was terrible. I'd have to get drunk sometime just to put up with them people. <laughs> I'm older than you, Joy. I'm 63. Okay, we're going to eat. We're going to eat. Yeah, I was hoping to get there before my first year, Steve. And God answered some prayers. Because we were only like 170 four weeks ago. Then that one video took off. I couldn't believe it. That's all it takes is one video to take off and you can climb quick sometimes, but you don't have the hours that you need. But that's okay. We'll work on the hours after we get the thousand. Yeah, we ready. Mm -hmm. Sit down. Hey, come on back. Is this hot? Yeah. It's hot. I'm going to eat it. Eat it. Hey. Eat here. All right. I'm back. I got my coffee made. To all you coffee drinkers. I Yay. Was, I was over there going to eat mm. mashed potatoes and gravy. Mm. Oh, she's. Right <laughs> Feed me. Hurry up. She's all kicked back. Got her leg. Well, mm. did have her leg. <laughs> She's easy riding. <laughs> she'll get in her stroller and do that with her stroller. Oh, she's, she's still got a cheetah. Yeah. <laughs> <Sure. laughs> oh, she's something else. She says, I don't care. You can stop showing me. I'm eating. <laughs> so, for all you coffee drinkers, here you go. All you Diet Coke drinkers go, here you go. I don't do carbonated drinks. No carbonation for me. Did a three-hour stream with Jess. Yeah. I know Jess is always doing lives and lives. Three-hour stream? She's supposed to have a 24-hour stream coming up. Oh, my goodness. I don't, I don't think I can handle that anymore. How would you do something like that? What would you find to talk about? You just cook, keep adding people to your screen and y'all have conversations. Really? Yeah. Like Sorry, y'all have to test like it. I could, add, I could add mom or Steve if we were on the computer doing it. Hmm. They're still preparing for that 24-hour one, huh? I couldn't, no. Well, maybe me and her get in on that, too, and, and be up there with y'all for a few minutes and let somebody else take our place. That's what she's going to have to do is just keep rotating people. <clears throat> I would like to uh, change our live days, though. We haven't been live in, in a couple in a of weeks. Wow. Yeah, I might delete that video and uh, change live days. Yeah. Well, what, once we get to 1,000, then we'll have our community page and people know more about us going live. Yeah. 
I need to do our bio also. It's yeah, I've seen awesome. that. I've seen, seen that, Mama Steve. You had to leave and go rescue a snake. What? <laughs> yeah. He, he's a snake man. Oh, no. Oh, no, Toto. We're not in Kansas no more. Somebody had a snake in their driveway and he wouldn't and got it. I, I'm not even going to say what I was always told growing up about snakes. Oh, Jason, Jim, <laughs> you're going to be singing Misery and Jim. <laughs> Old Merle Haggard song. Here, baby. Here. No. You can't do that. There. You get some weird notifications from YouTube. It just popped up shed wars. <laughs> People at the last minute getting their shed wars videos in, huh? I'm not shoveling it in fast enough. Oh, okay, I won't delete it then. We just act like we still go live. I don't know if anybody even watched that about going live on Wednesdays. It's hard to deal. It's hard to deal with Autumn and go live on a weekend. And then with me getting home so late from work, I can wait till they go to bed and break out the. Alcohol and get in here and go live. <laughs> no. We're going to have a uh, whiskey meetup live stream. He had talked about coffee and biscuits and gravy with Autumn in the mornings. I'm doing the live? Mm -hmm. mm, I don't think so. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. Look. Uh. Has Chrissy been on here yet? So, so do you play, Jason? Hey, Bomber, have you ate snake before? They used to have a TV show. Do a rain dance. <laughs> they used to have a TV show about these... Um, animal control people that would go around doing the snakes and the gators and stuff like that. I couldn't even watch mm. those. Mm. Yeah. Mm. I know. I'm a, I play a little bit. Played in a little band a little bit, but I yeah, don't baby. sing. My old voice it's getting kind of rough nowadays. Ugh, I can't even hardly talk half the time. Sing Aller in the shower. Allergies keep me messed up. <clears throat> if you sing now, in the shower, you now can if I drink a little bottle. whiskey, that clears up my throat. <laughs> then I'll then I'll sing. They used to ask me go in the band, you gonna sing? I said, I ain't drunk enough. <laughs> oh, really, Bummer? Yeah. Have you dealt with any of the saltwater snakes in the ocean out there, Bummer? There you go, Jason. 
they they probably have them nowadays that uh, correct you if you're flat or sharp or <laughs> to keep you in on key, keep you in tune. We'll have to get the other guitar players and uh, about four or five of us to get on screen and try to play a song together. <laughs> What you're done? <laughs> she's done. I think that's what she <laughs> said. She it's says, I'm done. Like I'm done. What, baby? Huh? <laughs> Tell them. <laughs> Say, I'm on here too. <laughs> Say, I'm stealing the show. Yeah. So I'm going to be the star of this show. And this is going to be Autumn's channel, not ours. <laughs> Everybody's just going to come see Autumn. <clears throat> yeah. Let me go check the. I'll tell you this. Let me go check the camera. Yes. That's why I was asking Mama to see if, if you ever seen one, but they're not. You don't run into them, I guess, that often. I've seen them on TV where they said just one little bite and you're gone. Okay, Bomber. I need to go taste test this green chili stew because she's never made it and I don't know how it tastes right now. Oh, that's hot. Uh -huh. I don't need a big spoon in my mouth. I don't need a big spoon. I need a big spoon. Got a little bite to it. Needs a little salt. Little more salt. She ain't happy with you. Little Ooh, more brown cumin. I that much more. Get more cilantro. All got the phone. That's some pretty good eating there. Cook a little while longer. Let the stove on. Anyway, you can put as much pepper in there as you like. That's why it's called green chili stew, because of the green peppers. They run off the lid. What's wrong with her? It ain't sleepy time. 
I never even heard of growing <laughs> cumin, Jason. <laughs> I guess you got to get it some way or another. Yep. <clears throat> but we don't have the climate that Mexico does. Okay. It's, it's, it's cumin and camino all grown in uh, Mexico, or they grow it here in the United States. I don't know. I don't study stuff like that. Mm -mm. I'm not big on agriculture. I'm just a little bit on agriculture. <laughs> no enough to feed us if it really had to. Thank you. Hey, what are you doing? <laughs> you wanna to come to me? That's a Papa's baby. Oh yeah, oh, Papa's yeah. little girl. Yeah, yeah, of course, he's with her more than than I am. No, she don't want no mom. No, say leave me alone. I don't want no baby. Got a kiss? Can I have a kiss. You can't have this. You can't have coffee. You can have this. No, she don't want that. <laughs> she does. No, she, don't. she wants to drink it. He's like, no. I'm so illegal to import. Worm factories? Worms to Hawaii when I was selling worm factories. Huh. Wants to come on. <laughs> <clears throat> come on, Booger. I. I ain't figured out how to do that though. Ask it. Hmm. There's no tight box for brandy. On Brandy's phone. This, this is crazy. The other way. Just for a minute. Hmm. Mm -mm. What's that crazy? Do you have to hit live chat or something? What are you talking about? I don't know. <laughs> Probably guess. Yummy, yummy. He's trying to figure it out. Hey. You're leaking milk. No, ma'am. I don't see a place to type back to y'all on this thing. Layout. Post to come. There it is. Well, it, it ain't. Oh, sweet baby. Have another baby kiss? Mm. Baby kisses. Mm. Yeah. 
Let me switch it back this way. I'm playing with this thing. Y'all hang in there with me. <laughs> this is just crazy. What we'll slideshow reply? <laughs> well, you know what? I can switch to the laptop real quick. I'm going to switch to the laptop and uh, See how this goes. I, we're still new at this live stuff. <clears throat> a stream yard on your phone don't really have a place to type. And when I did find the place to type, the key the keypad wouldn't come up. Yeah. 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 Okay. I seen StreamYard is getting bought out. Let's see if ours comes up here. Yeah, there it is. Coffee calmed you down from being hyper as a kid? You think with all the caffeine, it would make you even the, more hyper. The reverse thing. Hi, Keto. Hello. Yeah. 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 yeah, you'd think that the coffee would definitely. Close that one. Okay. Close this one. We're, we're closing out. Close. 